Hello guys. We are now, this is Tuesday, okay? We finally come to the end of the whole Black Friday, Cyber Monday, whatever, blah, blah, blah. So, as somebody in retail, I'm going to tell you the things that I hate about Black Friday. Because I know you guys, as shoppers, have things that you hate about Black Friday. I'm going to tell you what the people that work in your stores think about Black Friday. Buckle in, kiddies, it's going to be a bumpy ride. Number one, it's called Black Friday. I'm a little confused about how it became Black Saturday, Black Sunday, Cyber Monday. Like, this is called Black Friday. One day. It's not called Black Fortnite. Go home and see your family, maybe. They, maybe they miss you. There are people everywhere. I couldn't even get into like a parking spot in order to get in. My mom was trying to drop me off. There's people everywhere. You're trying to walk into your store. There's people everywhere. They're, they're touching you because they have to walk past you and you're like, get away from me, people please. And that's just annoying. I like people. I like to talk as I'm sure you can tell. But when they're just all around me in like a big cluster and I'm harassed, that's not so fun. People treat this day like it's a freaking apocalypse. My store was like a hurricane ran through it. I feel like I would be folding for an undetermined amount of time. It could have been 10 minutes, it could have been four hours. I'm not really sure. But I walk away, I'm finally done. I look at my little display and I'm just looking at it with pride. I work so hard on it. I turn around, I turn back for a second look. And it's just like people were taking, taking the piles and just throwing them over their shoulder. That's sort of how it felt. Actually, as a matter of fact, I got to see a child in a stroller take the bottom sh like shirt and just grab the whole thing and just throw it on the floor. And I know you're not supposed to beat the children of others, but if I could, I would have. Just like, don't do that. You know how long that took me? Have a little respect, baby. The next thing is getting things in the back. Customers are always asking me, do you have this in the back? Can you go check the back? Can you go check the back again? Can you check the back one more time? The back, there is nothing in the back. And do you want to know why? Because you guys bought everything in this store. You guys purchased every single thing in here. There was nothing in the back. But maybe I'll check the back for some more patience to deal with the rest of you people for the rest of today. When people ask me what the return policy is, and for the most part, I usually, obviously, I don't care. That's no big deal. But on Black Friday, or Black Saturday, or a Black six months from now, people act like it's, they need this thing. If they don't get this shirt, their life will be over. They need this shirt. I I'm running around the store, I'm sweating, I'm climbing ladders and looking behind things and doing all this crazy crap. And then I hand it to them, finally, and they're like, uh, I'm not so sure. Not so sure? What kind of disrespect? You just made me do a friggin' obstacle course. It was like fear factor in here. And I, now you don't want it? You're not sure? No. The final thing is when people ask me, oh, are you shopping during your breaks? Shopping during my breaks? I'm exhausted. You know what I do during my break? I hobble from my store to the nearest bench and I stare at my phone and just sit for 15 minutes trying to muster up the energy to get through this day. And that's my list of things that I have learned from this Black Friday that I do not like, and these are things that I have to deal with. So I'm sure if you're working in retail, you understand and you're like, hallelujah, girl. So um, thank you for watching. I know once again that I post pretty infrequently and it's because of school. So um, thank you and I'm gonna see you guys next time. Have a little respect, baby.